Pikachu and Friends in Story Time. One day, Miss Dorothy, Cha Cha's teacher, made an announcement. Children, we're going to have a costume party at school tomorrow. Everyone must dress up in a costume of your choice. There'll be a prize for the best costume. So please, make sure your costume is an interesting one. Cha-Cha liked dinosaurs very much, and so he wanted to go to the costume party as a dinosaur. I'll wear a dinosaur costume, and I'll say, Roar! Roar! <laughs> <laughs> Mr. Charlie, Cha-Cha's father, helped Cha-Cha look for a dinosaur costume. I like this costume, Daddy. Please buy me this costume. The costume Cha-Cha chose was very expensive. This costume is very expensive, Cha-Cha. Do you really want it? It will be of no use to you after the costume party. You won't be able to wear it or do anything with it again. Huh, that's right, Daddy. Mr. Charlie took Cha-Cha for a walk. He pointed out to Cha-Cha how there was garbage everywhere. Cha-Cha, look at all these cans and boxes. People have thrown them away, even though they can be used again. Why don't we take them home and use them to make a dinosaur costume? We'll save a lot of money and we'll be helping nature too. Good idea, Daddy! Mr. Charlie and Cha-Cha took the cans and boxes home. They used them to make a dinosaur costume. When the costume was ready, Cha-Cha saw that it looked even better than the one he had wanted before. Hooray! This costume is even better than the one I had wanted. Let me wear it and roar! Roar! <laughs> the next day, Cha-Cha wore the dinosaur costume to school. All the children admired it. Wow! Your dinosaur costume looks great, Cha-Cha! You look like a real dinosaur! Yes! <laughs> Roar! Miss Dorothy asked Cha-Cha and all the other children to stand on the stage. Please tell everyone about your costumes, children! <laughs> When it was Cha-Cha's turn, he told everybody about his dinosaur costume. Hi, everyone. I am a recycled dinosaur. My daddy and I made this costume with old cans and boxes. We use recycled materials so that we don't waste anything or harm nature. If we all reuse and recycle things, we can save trees and help the environment. Everyone was happy to hear how Cha-Cha and Mr. Charlie had made the dinosaur costume. And Miss Dorothy asked everyone to clap for Cha-Cha and Mr. Charlie. Let's all clap for Cha-Cha and Mr. Charlie. And let's try to be like them and make our costumes by recycling things next time. If we do that, we'll not only save money, 
but we will also save nature. Soon, it was time to announce the name of the winner. And the prize for the best costume goes to... Cha-Cha, the recycled dinosaur. Cha-Cha was very happy that he had won the prize. Recycle and reuse whatever you can. Roar! That reduces waste and helps our planet and the environment. Catch, Choo Choo! I'm okay, honey. It's just my back. It kind of hurts. All that bending and twisting from cleaning the car has made my back sore. Aw, oh, honey. Maybe it's time we got you that car vacuum cleaner. Um, not yet. It cost a fair bit of money. And there are other important things we need to save up for right now. <laughs> what took you so long? Huh? What happened? Why do you look so sad, Choo Choo? I just overheard Mommy and Daddy talking. Daddy's back hurts. Oh no! Why? because of how much he has to bend while cleaning the car. He needs a car vacuum cleaner. But I heard Daddy say that right now there isn't enough money for it. Idea! We could help! You know those jars in which we've saved our pocket money? Let's give those to Mommy to buy a car vacuum cleaner with. Great idea! Let's go! Pocket money we've saved. We can use it to buy a car vacuum for Daddy. We know his back hurts. We heard you talking. He really needs one. Aw, you adorable sweethearts. You're such kind and generous kids. So, can we go to the store and buy one right away? Oh, darlings! It's so sweet of you to offer all your saved pocket money. But I'm afraid it won't be enough for a car vacuum cleaner. But don't you worry. We can make this work. You see, I've got some money saved up, too, for a vacuum for Daddy. We can add your pocket money to this. And let's see. We need just a little bit more. And here's a plan. Father's Day is just a few days away. Now, if you both can save a little more and fill up your jars in the next few days, We'll have enough to buy the vacuum cleaner and give it to Daddy as a Father's Day gift. That's a great plan, Mommy. We can do that, right, Cha-Cha? Yes, we can. Great. The gift money Grandpa gave us today. 
reward that Mr. Williams gave me for helping him rake his garden. What Cusley's mommy gave me for helping carry her groceries out of the car. What Mrs. Williams gave us for babysitting Kucha while she did her video call. Well done, Choo Choo and Cha Cha. Keep going. Wow! I want a chocolate cone with sprinkles. Maybe I could take some money out of my jar. But if I spend some of the saved money on ice cream, there won't be enough for Daddy's gift. Buying an ice cream is not as important as buying Daddy's gift. All right! You kids did it! You've managed to save what we need for Daddy's gift. And tomorrow's Father's Day. We'll go to the store first thing in the morning and buy the gift. Right, Mommy? That's right, kids. Tomorrow's the day. Yippee! I'll get it! Hey, Cha-Cha. Look what I just bought from the toy store with my pocket money. Wow! That's so cool! Whoa! A convertible! Hey! I want one too! I've got a lot of pocket money saved up! Mommy! Cusley just got a super cool toy car! It goes really fast! And you know what? The top opens up! Mommy, can I use some of that saved money to get a car like that? <laughs> wow! That sounds like quite an awesome car, Cha-Cha! And of course, you can have your saved pocket money. But remember, money once spent is gone. And maybe we won't be able to buy Daddy's gift tomorrow. Gone? Huh? No gift for Daddy! But we've been saving up just for that all these days! I'm gonna stick with the plan. I'm gonna hold on to the saved money for Daddy's gift, Mommy. Excellent decision, Cha-Cha. Huh? Happy Father's Day! Whoa! Happy Father's Day! Aw, oh, thank you! This is such a wonderful surprise! But how did you manage this? You'll be proud to know, honey, that Choo Choo and Cha Cha have been saving their pocket money for many days. And their savings helped us buy this gift. Oh, my darlings. I'm so proud of you. What a thoughtful gift. Now my back won't hurt anymore. It's the best gift ever. From, From the, the best, best kids, kids ever. ever. Watch me go, Choo Choo! That's so cool, Cha Cha! Isn't my bike great, Choo Choo? It is! 
I guess it's because you take such good care of it, Cha-Cha. I just love, love, love my bike! But where's Cusley? Why is he taking so long to get here? I can't wait for all of us to ride our bikes together! Did someone mention the greatest and smartest kid? Well, here he comes! <laughs> Hi, <laughs> That's a cool new bike, Cusley! It is! Only the best for the best! Watch this! you get this bike, Cusley? We got it at the mall. Mommy bought me this new one because my old one's broken. This one cost a lot of money. Hey, do that dinosaur war thing again, Cusley. <coughs> wow, what a cool bike. Yeah, it is a really nice bike. But come on now, Cha-Cha and Cusley. Let's get to the fun part. Let's start riding our bikes. Let's go! It's made me thirsty. Hey, how about we take a break and go inside for some juice? That's a great idea, Choo Choo. Even though all great ideas usually come from me. Because I'm the... Yeah, yeah, you're the greatest. We know. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like you kids have had a great time cycling together. Yes, Mommy! Yes, Mrs. Charlie! How about you, Cha-Cha? What's the matter, Cha-Cha? Mommy, I need a new bike. Something like Cusley's. Huh? But the bike you have right now isn't broken. Yeah, your bike works so well. And you love it so much, Cha-Cha. Cha-Cha, sweetheart, why do you say that? Is there something wrong with your bike? Mommy, I don't like my bike anymore. And why's that, Cha-Cha? Because... because it's not a cool bike. And what's a cool bike, Cha-Cha? Oh, you know, something that costs a lot of money. And has all fancy things like lights and stuff. And everyone looks at it and goes, wow! Aw, oh, Cha-Cha, I think I understand what you're feeling. We all feel like this sometimes. Feel like what, Mommy? Well, sometimes when we see something fancy that our friend has, we begin to feel that what we have is not good enough. Just because it's not expensive. But isn't an expensive thing better, Mommy? Not really, sweetheart. Here, I want you to try something for yourself. Here are two pencils, Cha-Cha. This one costs a lot more money than this one. Now, 
go ahead and try both and tell me which one makes you write better. Okay, Mommy. They both work exactly the same, Mommy. Yeah, no difference. So you see, Cha-Cha? A pencil that doesn't cost a lot of money and doesn't have a bunch of lights and stuff did the job just as well as the expensive one. Yeah, Mommy. That's right. Do you think it's the same way with bicycles as well? I'm sure you'll find out for yourself, Cha-Cha, that a regular bike can be as good and as much fun as an expensive one. Now, all of you run along and go cycle some more. See you, See you later, later, Mommy! Hi, Mr. Roberts! Hi, Bingo! Hi, kids! <laughs> oh no! Bingo, come back! Oh no! What if he goes on the street? There are cars there! We've got to do something! Let's go after him! Thank you, Cha-Cha! You saved Bingo! You were amazing! That was unbelievable, Cha-Cha! Yeah! You rode your bike like a champ! I can't thank you enough, Cha-Cha! By the way, that's one cool bike you have! I love, 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 love my bike! <laughs> Mommy, I just found out for myself that a regular bike can be as good and as much fun as an expensive one. That's awesome, Cha-Cha. Well, everyone knows that I'm the greatest and all my things are the greatest. But when it comes to bikes... Cha-Cha's Cha -Cha's bike, bike is, is the, the greatest! greatest. Choo Choo. This is a really funny book that I'm reading. I'm enjoying it so much that I don't feel like putting it down. But I guess I'll have to put it away soon. Because I've promised Taku that I'll help him with his puppy puzzle. And I've promised Cha Cha that I'll teach him to draw a dinosaur like this one. Do you also want to learn to draw this? Come, I'll show you how it's done. Choo-choo. You remember you promised me that you'd teach me how to make a big dinosaur drawing for my wall? Can we start now? Cha-cha, can you give me a few minutes, please? I'll quickly read a few more pages of this funny book and then we'll start. I promise. But Choo-choo, you promised we'd start at 10 o'clock and it's already past 10 now. Yeah, I know. But wait just a few minutes more. Okay, Cha-Cha? Okay, I'll wait. <laughs> Choo-choo? Baby? Puzzle? Hey, Baby Taku. I remember. I promised to help you with your jigsaw puzzle. But can we do it a little later, please? Please, baby brother. Later? Yes, in just a few minutes, I promise. Okay, baby Taku? <laughs> 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 
Choo choo! <laughs> Can we start the dinosaur drawing now, please? Five more minutes, Cha Cha. I've reached such a funny part in the book. Why don't you go wait at the kitchen table? I'll be right with you. I promise, okay? Puzzle? Give me five more minutes, baby Taku. Why don't you go wait at the kitchen table with Cha Cha? I promise I'll be there in five minutes. <laughs> Hi! Is anyone here? Wanna play? Chiku? We're in the kitchen, Chiku! Hi! Uh, what's up? Why do both of you look sad? We're waiting for Choo Choo. She promised to help us with my dinosaur drawing and Taku's puppy puzzle. And? And she keeps breaking her promise. She keeps saying five minutes, five minutes. Oh. That's why baby Taku and I are feeling sad. Yeah, I can understand. I feel sad and disappointed too when someone breaks their promise to me. Chiku, will you help us? Oh, sure. I want to learn to draw this dinosaur, Chiku. Let's start. First, draw a big mountain like this. Then, at this end, draw a small oval shaped like a leaf. Now, add a couple of eyes and a mouth and you have the dinosaur's face. Next, give it four legs and then some spikes on its back. Now, add some spots and color it. to the kitchen table. Look, Choo Choo! I've learned how to draw a dinosaur! Chiku taught me! Baby! Puzzle! Chiku! Cha-Cha and Taku, you went ahead and did all the fun stuff without me? You didn't even wait for me? But Choo Choo, we waited and waited for you! We asked you so many times! And you kept Breaking your promise, Choo Choo! Huh? Yes! You kept reading your book and you kept making us wait. And that made us very sad and disappointed. And then we stopped trusting you, Choo Choo. We weren't sure you'd help us at all. 
So we went ahead and asked Chiku to help us. What Cha-Cha is saying is right, isn't it? You're right, Cha-Cha. Nobody trusts someone who breaks their promise. I'm so sorry I did that to you and Taku. But now you'll never trust me again. Ah, Choo-Choo. Don't feel bad. We all learn from our mistakes. Please don't cry, Choo-Choo. We love you. Baby, love Choo-Choo. Aw, thank you. I'll never break my promise again. Never ever. Promise? I promise. <laughs> Ta-da! There it is! My shiny, super fast, zip, zap, zoom, sports car racing set! Vroom, vroom! Awesome, Cha-Cha! Looks like you're all set for your play date with Cusley. Yeah, Choo Choo! I can't wait to race these cars with him! And then we're going to take a cookie break! And then we're going to play another round of... Huh. Let me guess. Vroom vroom? <laughs> <laughs> Hey, look who's here to make your day. It's super adorable me. Oh, Cusley. Are you ready to race with me, Cusley? Of course I'm ready, Cha-Cha. Ready to win every single race? I'm the best race driver in Scottsdale. Well... I'm ready to start working on my science homework, too. I'll be right here. Have fun. Good, Good luck, luck with, with your, your homework, homework Choo-Choo. Um, Cha-Cha, but I should have the red car. It's the fastest, and you told me. No, Cusley. I always play with the red car. It's my lucky car! Right, Choo Choo? Tell Cusley that I always get to choose the red car! Um, that's right, Cusley. Cha Cha believes the red car is lucky for him. So we always let him choose it. But, but Cha Cha told me that I. Come on, Cusley. We always let him choose the red car. Not a big deal. Why don't you pick another car? <laughs> okay, okay, I'll take this gray one. I guess it doesn't matter, since I'm gonna win anyway. <laughs> Ready, set, go! Boom! Chacha's red speedster races to the finish line, leaving Cusley's gray car far behind. I won! I won! Better luck next time, Cusley! Hey, Chacha! Enough racing! Why don't I show you some super car stunts on this curving, loopy bridge? No, wait! We selected our sides of the track. The bridge is on my side, so I only get to use it. You drive your car on this twisting road. No, I want to show you some stunts on the curvy bridge. But Cusley, we already chose our sides. Now we have to stick with whatever we chose. Right, Choo Choo? If we've already decided our size, we can't change that in the middle of the game, right? Cha-Cha has a point, Cusley. It's best to play by the rules you two decided in the beginning of the game. If the bridge is on his side, he should be driving his car on it. But, 
Choo Choo. I didn't get to. It's okay, Cusley. It's just the game. Stop arguing and enjoy it. <sighs> I guess you're right. The best drivers don't need curving bridges. Let me show you some stunts on this flat road. Well then, there's no time to lose. Ready, set, go! Vroom, vroom! Wow, that was fun! What say we take a break? A cookie break! <laughs> Cookies! Chocolate chip! Yummy! Choco chip for me and... Peanut butter cookie for you, Cusley. Here you go. Enjoy! No! Not fair! Huh? But I want the chocolate chip cookie, Cha-Cha. I like chocolate chip cookies, too. I'll have this, and you can have two peanut butter cookies instead. No! It's got to be the chocolate chip for me. What happened, Cusley? What's going on with you two? Choo-Choo, Cusley and I, we both want chocolate chip cookies. There's only one. I offered Cusley two peanut butter ones, but he's not agreeing to it. Uh-huh. But Cusley, these are Chacha's favorite cookies. He only ever has chocolate chip cookies. That's good to know, Choo Choo. But here's what you don't know. I can't eat the peanut butter cookies because... Because you don't like them? Too bad, Cusley. No! Because I'm allergic to peanut butter. If I have a peanut butter cookie, I'll fall sick. I'm gonna call Mommy so she can take me home. Cusley! Cusley, wait! Call my Mommy. I wanna go home now. I'm so sorry, Cusley. I didn't know you were allergic to peanut butter. Or else, I would never ask you to eat these. I'm sorry too, Cusley. Here, I didn't need it. It's all yours if you want it. Yes, you should have it, Cusley. But it's not just about the cookie, Choo Choo. You've been taking Cha-Cha's side all day. Ever since I came over. And you don't even listen to what I have to say. You've been playing favorites with Cha-Cha, Choo-Choo. I was trying to tell you things. But you just weren't listening. I'm sorry. Well, you should be. But I'm listening now. Tell me everything you wanted to say. I'm listening too, Cusley. I'm sorry we made you feel bad. When we started playing the car race, I wanted the red car because Cha-Cha and I had made a deal the last time we played cars. He took the red car the last time. And he promised me that the next time we played, I could have it. And then he forgot his promise. And I was trying to tell you about it. But you didn't let me, Choo Choo. I'm sorry I cut you off, Cusley. You should have had the red car. I should have let you finish before deciding who should have it. And I'm sorry I forgot about our deal, Cusley. Thank you for being a sport and still playing with the gray one. Thanks, Cha Cha. I appreciate it. What else were you going to tell me before I stopped you, Cusley? Well, about the curvy bridge. Cha-Cha and I didn't get to decide together which side of the track would be whose. He'd already made the rules even before I got here. 
I'm sorry, Cusley. Yeah, I guess that wasn't fair to make the rules of the game all on my own. Even before you got here. It's all right, Chata. I guess you were excited to start the game as soon as I arrived. Oh no, and you were trying to tell me that, and I didn't hear you out. And it seemed like I was playing favorites with Chacha today, that I was listening only to him and not you. I feel so terrible about this. I guess I was just trying to play fair with what I knew about my own brother, but I should have also listened to your side before deciding. But I promise you, from now on, I will listen to both sides before I decide what's fair. We all should. Yes. Thank you, Choo Choo. And thank you, Cha Cha. You listen to me now, and I feel better already. Besides, I guess you had to learn from the smartest and the best anyway. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Cusley. You know, I have another idea about making it up to you for today, Cusley. have your own racing set, too. So you can race your car anywhere you like. Even when you're playing by yourself. Oh, wow. That's awesome, Choo Choo. But I thought this was going to be your science homework. Well, I've got all day to make more windmills. And I enjoy it. Oh. In that case, I think you shouldn't play favorites and make me a new city racing set, too! <laughs> Hi! I'm Choo Choo! My brother Cha Cha and I are waiting for our friends to get here and then we'll all play together out in the yard! Until then, We'll watch some TV. You know the thing about watching TV? You've got to be careful. Because sometimes there's some not so good stuff that you can pick up off of TV. And that's what happens to Cha Cha. Come with me. Okay, just for a few minutes till your friends get here. It's Superhero X! <laughs> <laughs> He's so funny! Hey! Out of my way! Kapow! <laughs> <laughs> He's so cool! Give me that, funny face! So funny! Loser! I'm the boss! Isn't he super funny? <laughs> yeah. Hey, that must be our friends. Come on, Cha Cha. Let's go out and play. Okay, 
Choo Choo and I will play. Huh? Why is everyone leaving? We were having fun. wants to play with you, Cha-Cha. And let me explain why. Why is no one playing with me, Choo-Choo? It's not fair. Because you're being all rough and rude, Cha-Cha. Huh? Rude? Rough? Why do you say that, Choo-Choo? You've been pushing and shoving and making rude faces at people. You've been calling them rude names like Loser and Funny Face. But, but... I was just doing all the cool and funny stuff that Superhero X does on TV. You were laughing at Superhero X too, Choo Choo. Remember? Yeah. But it's not okay to copy stuff you see on TV. But why? Because Superhero X is a cartoon. He's not a real kid. And the people Superhero X says all that stuff to are not real either. But you're a real kid, Cha-Cha. With real brothers and sisters and real friends that have real feelings. You really hurt everyone's feelings, Cha-Cha, by being rude and rough. Real kids don't do that. Thanks for explaining the difference, Choo-Choo. I thought it was okay for real kids to try to act like the cartoons they see on TV. But I get it now. I don't want to be a rude kid. That's great, Cha-Cha. Let's go fix it. Oh, oh no. no! I know, I know. I've been really rude. But I'm very sorry. I'm sorry for pushing and shoving and calling you names. I was trying to act like a cartoon I saw on TV. And now I understand it's not okay to do that. We were wondering what had gotten into you. It's okay. We're all friends again. Thank you, my friends. And by the way, Cha-Cha, if you want to act like someone, just act like me because I'm the coolest. <laughs> 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 